Hello guys. Some of you had problems with installing or downloading Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Um, so when the download reach certain uh, level, I would say, and under the FS space file, it will just st stop and resume downloading from the beginning. So I would show you how to fix this problem. For in, in my case, it stacks around 600 megabytes. So yeah, this is as far as it goes and then it will resume from the beginning. You check here now see there you go so how to fix this problem um, I would wait till this reach on 400 and then I will pause it now it's 150 something so you need an access to hidden folders so just type in the search bar hidden show hidden files and you scroll down to change settings to show headings and system you click show settings and make sure to open the file explorer option and then click show hidden files folders under hidden files and folders click ok so i'll go back to the game and pause it around 400 megabytes Ah, yeah, I'll pause it just here and then I will go and search for the hidden folder of the downloaded files. It will be under user, then you click your username. In my case, it's just PC, application data, local, and then. I think it's packages, yes, and then Microsoft Flight Simulator, there you go, here. Local cache data, and then packages and then officials one store so if you scroll down till the end you will see you will see the huge fs base files select them all cut and then you create a folder in your desktop if you wish or any other file and you paste them there now if you go back and resume the download so again you need these files that you place in the folders you will paste them again in the same path it's just to fix this problem that the system thinks that the files isn't there and then it will continue downloading without issue it's just to fix this bug so you remember now the download stopped at this point now it continues as you see 700 7717 0.71 five percent and it will continue to do so to download so i hope this video is helpful to you there you go so i'm not an expert in computer stuff as so i just uh, thought that this might help some of you guys this is how it helped me so i hope this is helpful for you too thank you for watching